Hi there, it's Claire from Clarified Creations, and if you're new to this channel, I'm a junior nursing student at the University of Tennessee, Knoxville, and this video is going to be all about preparing for my first ever clinical rotation. So I am brand new to all of this. I have never stepped foot in a hospital, so I thought I'd take you guys along for a little day in my life and preparing for clinicals, because seriously guys, I have so much to do. I've got to go check out where the hospital is. I'm pretty sure I know where it is, but if you're kind of unfamiliar with clinicals, a bunch of the nursing students get assigned a certain hospital to go, and that's where your clinicals are. So there's many different hospitals around Knoxville and even surrounding areas, so you never know which one you're going to get. I'm going to meet my friend Sarah, and we're going to go drive to the clinical location. Also, we're going to get lunch, and then afterwards, I have health assessment from one to four, and guys, it's my last ever health assessment class because I have my final next week. November is going by so fast and by the way it's currently November 10th and then after I get done with health assessment I'm gonna go to Walmart get some clinical snacks and get just ready for the day. So with that being said let's go and meet Sarah. Okay so we made it. There's Sarah. Hi. Yep we <laughs> got to the hospital. Not gonna tell you where it is for privacy reasons. Mm -hmm. We don't want to get kicked out of nursing school. Yeah definitely don't want to do that but we're gonna go in the hospital and act like we are supposed supposed to be there. Yep. Even though we're not. Yeah. <laughs> I came along to help her with directions. <laughs> she she's, did? She's directionally challenged. I... Comment below if you are too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let, let us know. Yeah. All right, well, we're going to go in and then we're going to go back to UT and we're going to get some good lunch. Sarah and I got some blend smoothies. Which one did you get? I forgot. <laughs> we got the Happy Hippie smoothie. <laughs> <laughs> strawberry, banana, and mango. I asked for it without banana, but I'm pretty sure they still put bananas in it, so it's a little banana-y for my taste, but overall, it's not bad. Thanks, Sarah. You're welcome. She bought it for me. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, the University of Tennessee bought it for me because they gave us free dining dollars, so it's nice. Mm-hmm. Okay guys, we got some free Chick-fil-A at the Big Orange Give. What is it? It's a chicken. Okay, it's a chicken sandwich. Classic Chick-fil-A staple. So I'm gonna eat this and it's free lunch, which is really nice. Also guys, I won this free tumbler. It says UT alumni. I'm not quite there yet, so I'm gonna give it to my dad. And Sarah got, what, a scarf? Like a, flag. A, a flag. Hey guys, I made it to the health assessment parking lot and I'm going to go in for my last health assessment class of the semester. So it's currently 1237, so I'm going to go inside and just get situated and also study some things. So I will see you guys in three hours. I'm at Walmart now. I just finished up with health assessment, so I'm going to go grab some snacks for tomorrow and just kind of see what all I can find. I have a general idea. I know I want to get protein bars and maybe some Lara bars. I heard those are really good, so we'll just have to see what they have and what we can find. Okay, we're out of carts, so we're going to see what all we can carry with our hands. Yep, I'm pretty experienced with that though, so it should be okay. Do I want these Belvita sandwiches? They're dark chocolate, so they are healthy, but they do have 12 grams of sugar. I'm going to think about that. Okay everyone, as promised, I'm gonna show you the things I got from Walmart. I didn't vlog very much in there because I didn't have a cart and they were out of it, so I was carrying all the things in my hands and just picking up the camera. I tried, it did not work out well. You can ask the tons of people that walked by me as I kept dropping things. I mean, I dropped a good four things on one 30 minute trip to Walmart. The first thing I got was a Lara Bar pack. I've never tried these before. I know that they do have dates in them and I'm not a big fan of dates. You're probably thinking, why did you get that if you don't like dates? Because they're supposed to be really healthy and they sounded good. Peanut butter chocolate chip. I love peanut butter and I love chocolate chips. And the best part about these, they only have four grams of sugar. So I know if I don't like them, my dad likes dates so he can have them. I just thought I'd give it a try. And also let's open it because they say they have holiday designs. Oh wow. These are tiny. <laughs> what they are. 
No holiday designs, but got some Lara bars. Good old Nature Valley biscuits with peanut butter. I have a theme here. Peanut butter is a really good friend and is protein. So you're getting some extra protein for the morning. And these only have eight grams of sugar. And my dad and I both agree, they taste like a giant Nutter Butter. They're so good and very tasty, and I'm sure they're way healthier than eating a Nutter Butter, so I don't even feel bad about eating these. Got a giant family size pack of Chex cereal. Yep, it's just cereal. I could probably make some snacks out of these too, so, and it was on sale for $3. I don't know if that's really a sale, but I figured it was better than paying $3.18 for a small pack of Cheerios. And last but not least, I got this Mio Energy stuff to put in my water. Because if you know me personally, I really struggle with drinking water. And I'm going to be at the hospital for eight hours tomorrow. And I really should be drinking water, especially if I'm going to be all over the floor running around all day. And the best part about this, it has B vitamins and it has a little bit of caffeine too. I've decided I'm not going to be drinking coffee in the mornings just because it makes me kind of jittery but I think a little bit might help me. Okay, so that wraps up all the things I bought. So I'm gonna just get ready for the night. I'm gonna unpack my backpack and then just try and get everything together. So I will be updating you periodically about everything that happens. Also need to iron my scrubs as well, print off some papers. I'm gonna be busy tonight and it's currently 548. So I do need to get going and just make sure that everything is done so I don't have to stress out tomorrow morning. And then next I've got my uniform all laid out. Got UT, my white nursing compression socks. So I'm gonna be ironing this because it's kind of wrinkly and I don't want it to be wrinkled for the hospital. So let's figure out how to use this iron. I am terrible at ironing things. That's why I never do it, but we're gonna do it anyways. And then the last thing that's part of my uniform is I have this under scrub shirt because I get cold really easily. So I'm gonna put this away, go downstairs and iron. recently discovered that I'm really bad at ironing things. I mean, take a look at all those wrinkles. You can't really see them on camera, but they are there and it didn't go too well with the iron. I ended up creating more wrinkles than when it was originally. So I am going to revert to my friend Mr. Steamer and we're going to see if steaming my scrubs work better for me. I'm just about done packing my lunch and the first thing I've got is some lasagna. It's currently frozen. It's a little bit crispy on the edges, but it's okay. I can pick that off. So I'm going to put that in the fridge and it'll be defrosted by tonight or tomorrow morning and then I'll stick it in the hospital fridge when I get there. Got some oranges for some healthiness and it's kind of the only fruit we have. And I went ahead and peeled it just so I don't have to do that at the hospital and I can just grab and go and put it in my scrub pocket if I want. And then some sun chips. These are the Harvest Cheddar. These are my favorite chips ever. I really love those. I got Lara Bar or Nature Valley Peanut Butter Biscuits. Now I'm not really sure if I'll like this one, so I went ahead and grabbed two, and I'll have this in the morning before I head into the hospital. So this is kind of like my breakfast bar. Some water with this energy thing I'm gonna put in, and I'll do that tomorrow. And then the other thing I'm gonna be packing is vitamin water, and this is the zero sugar lemon one. And this is just for extra vitamins and nutrients. So I've got everything and now I'm gonna put it in this lunchbox and put it in the fridge. I'm going to end the vlog here and I'm gonna pick it back up tomorrow because I do have to get up at five in the morning and I still need to get ready to go to sleep and everything. So I will see you guys bright and early tomorrow. Bye.